We may be the land of the free, but we're the home of the divided, with store owners and society preparing for what might happen after today. I don't think it's normal at all. I don't think anything about the last four years has been normal. Thank you. Will the election start the healing or widen the divide? Unfortunately, with everything going on right now, I don't think too much unity is going to happen. Nothing's going to happen that's going to match the Civil War. I don't care what occurs, that ain't going to be it. Dr. Norm Provisor is a political science professor at Metropolitan State University of Denver. He says today's tensions are nothing new historically. If you look at a lot of film from 1968, it looks a lot very familiar to today. With issues of race and social justice. We have some bitterness, we have some real bitterness, uh, and you can see it very much. He says if we can learn from history, the election will not start the healing process. I think everybody does need to come together regardless, even after everyone puts their vote in. But Provisor says history shows the states will be united once more. I just hope that we'll all come back to where we were and maybe be even better than we were. Down the road, not immediately, but down the road, those two paths converge. They come together. That is the best of all possible outcomes. In Denver, Nelson Garcia, 9 News.